Hey, good morning. Jeremy Wilgus here. Happy Friday Eve, everybody. We got one more day, then we're on to Friday. There's just something about like the end of something that seems like it coasts for me, right? I don't know. I used to think it was hard, the end of something, like, oh, we're almost there, but it seems so far away now to me, like, whether it be working out, whether it be driving, whether it be whatever, right? Like, the end seems like the easy part. The middle is where it gets tough. The beginning is like a warm-up, the middle is where it's really tough, and then the end's kind of like a coast. Because I'm already on this path up the whole time. So it's like I just coast to the top. And when I hit the top, you know, I'm done. Good to go. And I can start climbing all over again the next day, right? So today what I want to talk about is pushing through, right? I want to talk about perseverance and things like that, right? Because you have two choices in life. Give up or go forward. That's it. There's no middle ground in life. You either give up, curl up like a little fried shrimp, go up underneath of a rock, and live your life there, or you go forward. There's no being stagnant in life. You know, if you're not moving forward, you're bound to go backwards because life just has its way of moving so fast that even if you stay in one point too long, it just blows you by, right? Um, I feel like perseverance is so important because life does throw travesties at us, throws trials and tribulations and hardships, and Perseverance is something that's needed to push forward. But there's a lot of people... Excuse me. Yeah. What happens at 3.51 in the morning? <laughs> so, I feel like a lot of times people think about um, the possibility of like... Just staying where they are and you can't do that at all right like life throws us hardships man and we all have to deal with the hardships we all have to deal with stuff that we don't want to deal with on a daily basis you know we have to deal with loss heartache struggle trials tribulations failures inadequacies at times you know but it's okay you're not alone every single person has been there before and at some point throughout the day may be there again you know if there's a name for it it's already been done so stop thinking that you're alone in all of this too man that's that's a key component Maybe people are like, oh, woe is me, it's so hard, it's so hard. It's really not that hard because you were built to survive shit. You were built to push through. You are a human being. You're not an animal. There's no pecking order to this as far as brain capacity and all of that. You were built built to evolve to any situation that arises because you are a human being and we have been adapting our entire existence so don't give up you can't give up take giving up out of your whole entire life and out of your whole entire vocabulary i don't know what that is giving up those are made up words i don't know it I can't know it, because if I know it, I allow myself to have that as an option, and that cannot be an option, because you are a conqueror, you are a survivor, you are an overcomer, you are an achiever, let's achieve today, let's persevere through whatever life throws us, 
One of the things that helps me greatly in the morning is these videos. I'm up 3.30 in the morning. These videos are done usually by 4 o'clock. I'm doing my little mix and putting them together and putting them on all the social media and all the sites and, and, and everything. Um, and then I hit the gym. And you know why I do these things? Because every morning, 3.30 comes and it is a struggle to not hit the alarm clock. It is a struggle to, sometimes to come up with topics. It is a struggle sometimes to, to, to find the right words. And I do these in one take because I want them to be authentic. I don't try to redo the video a hundred times so it's perfect. The best one's always the first one. Then I go in this gym and I beat the shit out of myself. I spend a half hour in a sauna. I beat my, beat the, <clears throat> I beat my body up for 30 minutes on core or on a treadmill. Um, or both usually combined, like 15 minutes on each. Cardio, core. I beat my muscles up 45 minutes to an hour each muscle group. And why do I do that? Because once I've accomplished all of that, by 7 o'clock in the morning... I have overcome the most continuous stress that the day will throw at me. So when the hardships do come, I'm able to adapt and know that it's not going to be as long as this morning was. It's not going to be as hard as that gym was. It's not going to be as trying as 30 minutes in a sauna. You know, and there's things you can do if you're not a gym person. There's activities you can do to build that strength. So today, build that strength and know that you are a conqueror. You are an overachiever. You are an overcomer. And you will conquer today. Listen, I love you all. I want you to be blessed. Stay blessed. And remember, gratitude keeps you from feeling stressed. Have a good one.